And as communities across the country prepare for this growing coronavirus, many parents are wondering how schools plan to respond. CBS 13's Bursa Perlman is in Citrus Heights getting answers. Area school districts are warning parents about the potential for a coronavirus outbreak. And here at San Juan Unified, they're bringing out the big guns, telling parents they're prepared for anything. So the machine is called a Texas. Staff at Mesa Verde are ready to suit up to use the Texas, which sprays chlorine tablets on school surfaces. Leaders say the machine, hazmat suits, and other cleaning supplies are hard to get right now as the coronavirus spreads. It's just one of the tools in their toolbox to fight a potential outbreak of the coronavirus. We have everything, we have a plan, and we kind of know when the good trigger point would be to go in there and get some work done. They'll use this protocol only if a bad virus hits the district. Coronavirus is spreading at a time when school districts are already dealing with flu season. And fighting the coronavirus is a lot like dealing with the flu. If we have a confirmed case of coronavirus, we would respond appropriately to that, make sure that we're hitting the entire site and, and getting it disinfected. School closures are a possibility, and districts are planning for that. Closures are generally decided based on a percentage of absenteeism among staff and the student body. But leaders here say they're ready, stocking up on the cleaning supplies they need to fight the virus. We've worked with all of our vendors to provide us our product, making sure our product will work against everything that's potentially out there, and then make sure that our staff is trained and ready to go. With this protocol in place, the district is able to clean multiple campuses at the same time. It takes about 12 hours to clean one school top to bottom.